So Fatima from Saudi Arabia saying, what is the ruling on watching UFC? Uh, I think it's called Ultimate Fighting Championship or something like this, um, uh, while fasting. So it is MMA as well, mixed martial arts. Whether you're fasting or not, this is beside the point. Fasting has a status that must, must be honored when you're not fasting, more. So if I'm fasting, I may refrain from things that I wouldn't normally refrain from while I'm not fasting. So fasting should be more valuable to us than normal days. And this is why the Prophet told us some that fasting helps us to curb our sexual desires and to lower our gaze. Because I know that I'm fasting, I'm observing Allah Azza wa Jal and I'm lowering my gaze. Now, UFC is a violent sport that is dependent on choke, choking, uh, uh, locking, breaking the joints, and hitting the face. So the intention is to subdue and to harm your opponent in any way you can. And this is totally prohibited in Islam. Striking the face in Islam is totally haram. Don't pay any attention to famous Muslim boxers or famous MMA fighters. Hitting the face is something that our Pro Prophet ﷺ totally prohibited. End of story, full stop. So whether he's a Muslim, he's famous, he's doing la ilaha illallah when he fights and hits people, this is beside the points. He's not a companion. He's not a tabi'i. He's not even a scholar to be followed. He's just a fighter being paid for what he's doing, and what he's doing is against Islam. End of story. So whether you're fighting, you, you are fasting or not, it doesn't make any difference. What makes a difference is it's even worse for a female to watch such fights. Men who are almost not wearing any clothes and enjoying what you're seeing, this is not at all permissible or normal.